What's up, boys? You want to know why you struggling with women? Why you lost that girl? Or why you can't get that girl back? Or why you can't get that girl in the first place? Or any of that stuff, bro? It's because you struggle with getting too attached, bro. The thing is, the person who cares the least is always going to be in a position of power when it comes to men dealing with women or people dealing with people or however you want to throw that together, bro. So you always have to be in this space where you're not attached to an outcome. You're not attached to what, you, what it is that you... Some of y'all guys, bro, I ain't even gonna lie to you. Some of y'all guys, y'all get this thought in y'all head. Yeah, we gonna get married. We gonna have kids. We gonna do all of this stuff. And then when it don't turn out like that, you broken. You lose your job. You lose your kids. You lose everything that's going on. And it's because you got to attach to an outcome, bro. You got to attach to an outcome. Some of y'all guys go on first dates and it's like, oh yeah, she's so fine that when I get on this first date, I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do that. And I'ma say this and I'ma say that And you get so attached to this outcome Or what she's supposed to say Or how she's supposed to react to a certain thing That when she don't do that You stumped, you left her You don't know what to do You in a place where you like, I don't know what to do next I'm messed up, I don't know where to go You don't know how to react And so she get the competitive advantage against you because now you frozen and she not frozen she competing she know what she doing she is getting to it unlike you and you want to know why that is because she's not attached to an outcome because she got so many options that she don't need to be attached to an outcome you want to know what women think when they go out on dates with men what they mind frame is they mind frame is let's go see what happens I want to see what happens. I want to see how this guy come across. I want to see what he do. I want to see where we go and how it is and stuff like that. You want to know what most me and my frame is when it come to dating? Oh yeah, bro, she's so fine, bro. I'm gonna make her my girlfriend. I'm gonna do this. Cause you so attached to a relationship label or you so attached to what you want this woman to be in your life, bro. That at the end of the day, you don't actually live in the moment and see what is going on and calibrate your skills according to what you need to do, bro. For some of y'all guys who getting y'all girls back, bro, y'all ain't actually thinking about what's going on, what she's showing you, what she's saying to you when she finally do come back. Or even better, when she on social media and you are following her social media, which I don't recommend, you Oh my God, she out at the basketball game with this other guy. Oh my God, what do I do to get her back right now? No, bro, she out at the basketball game with another guy, bro. Think about that. What is that telling you? You need to calibrate instead of having your mind so stuck on this one woman that you can't think straight, bro. And that's what most guys do because y'all get too attached to these outcomes and you get so attached to this woman, this one woman or this one thing or this one variable, bro, that you can't see the whole picture. And guess what she does to you? She promptly takes advantage of that because guess what? It is in her nature. It is in female nature to finesse you. It is in female nature to take advantage of you and your weaknesses. Women pick at your weaknesses like chinks in an armor, bro. Partly it's to make you stronger as a man. Partly they made to pick at your weaknesses because you supposed to be getting stronger as a man. So she gonna pick at it and pick at it and pick at it until you figure it out. Or she realize you such a weak dude that she gonna leave. Or the alternative happens, bro. She realizes, oh, this guy got this weakness here that I can exploit for my advantage without having to give of myself. It's like how certain guys give too much of they, uh, they S energy, bro, without her giving anything in return. And then they get dicked around. It's the same, it's the same result, bro. When you dealing with a woman and you show her this weakness because you too attached, she going to figure out that weakness. She going to take advantage of that weakness. And she going to feel like, oh, well, I don't have to give certain things here because all I got to do is take advantage of that weakness. All I got to do is guilt trip this man. All I got to do is, you know, spin around in a circle because my body's so bad. All I got to do is stuff like that in order to get his attention, to divert his attention off the fact that I ain't really giving him no signals. 
I ain't really out here showing him that I'm down to escalate. I ain't really out here treating him the way I would treat the high value male. And so many guys y'all miss it. You miss it because you so you you focused on the end. And you not focused on what's happening in that moment. Cause you too attached, bro. You so attached to this outcome that as a man, you give up all your morality, bro, your your morals, and you give up all the things that you learn. Because you like, oh my gosh, she's special somehow. This woman is somehow special and different from all the other ones. And the reality is she ain't no different. She ain't no different from every other woman out there. And guess what she gonna go for? She gonna go for the man who don't treat her like she no different from any other woman out there. You got to prove to me that you worth this. You got to prove to me and show me that you get what I have to offer you. And that's the mindset that you should come with. You should have the mindset of, let's see what happens. Let's see what this woman show me. Let's see if she show me she a quality candidate to even go in my roster, let alone be my girl. Let her show me she a quality, quality candidate to be anything for me, bro. See, the thing is, you guys are so afraid and so insecure when it comes to a beautiful woman that she automatically gets a place and they should have to qualify themselves the same way that any other woman will qualify themselves to you bro do not get so attached to this outcome that you have for her that you don't want to make her qualify herself to you bro because that's when you show weakness in character bro she gonna realize you think she don't realize that that you think she pretty bro she know that when you tried to get at her bro she know that when you asked her on a date she know that when she broke up with you she know that when, when whatever happened bro she knows that you think she pretty bro what she what she find out later is she could use that to her advantage she could use that to make you do whatever she wants to like a little lap dog <laughs> yeah exactly bro she can make you do that because she pretty bro is that enough for you bro it's not supposed to be because guess what? If you live in the moment, if you stop getting so attached, you'll find that women get attached to you easier, bro. Because now they qualifying themselves. Now they the ones trying to figure out how to make you what they want you to be. Because now you like, all right, what you showing me? You get according to what you give. And what I mean by that is, you getting the best out of me when you give me the best out of you. When you give me less than the best, guess, you, guess what you gonna get, baby? You gonna get less than the best. And when you have this mindset, you don't get attached, bro. Because guess what? You, she, you give her what she's showing you. And if she don't show you a reason to get attached, why would you ever get attached? If anything, she gonna be the fastest one to get attached because now she the one trying to prove herself, bro. So get it together, bruh. Get it together, man. Click that video right there, man. Subscribe. It's your boy, Kaden the Ray. I'm out of here. Stop getting attached, man.